I just want to wish everyone a happy new year. Hopefully 2024 is more prosperous and lucky for everyone. And um, thank you for all your beautiful comments, for all your support, for all your coffees and all your, all your, your, your stuff you keep saying, all the positive things you keep g me up and g me on and keeping me going. And now Leon wants to say Happy New Year as well, look. Happy New Year, sausages. Filthy, filthy thumbs up. <laughs> Enjoy. Are your thumbs filthy today? No. Yeah, yes, uh, yeah, yeah. sort of filthy. Yeah. So anyway, Happy New Year from both of us. And uh, Sue is sausage. She says Happy New Year as well. But she celebrates Happy New Year in uh, February over there. So she'll fly over to Taiwan and celebrate. Thank you. And good night. What are you doing then? What? Interesting little area. I don't really like these 90s style buildings. This, this brick and this blue. Not a fan of that rippers. I think we're now entering Whittington. Whittington. Lovely Whittington. Lovely Whittington. Lovely little shed that is, isn't it? Beautiful little shed.
bridge number 82. Just moving, just moving the boat up a little bit because the signal's rubbish just back there. The, this is the plow, the plow moorings. And, um, oh god, it's so cold on the boat. There's lots of bad ninja fire at the front, but at the back, oof. I just sleep with like tracky bottoms on and a, and, a, and a jumper, you know what I mean? Not this shirt. It's a clean shirt. So, um, yeah, so I've had to do that. To do what? No, no sorry, moving the boat. <laughs> Swifting off. Moving the boat up a little bit to try and get a better signal. I'm very close to the van then, and I want to go shopping today, so I'm just, just meandering up a little bit. Leon's in bed. He's, what's he doing now? So works, he's his mate in his business on the internet. I think it's doing stuff for abroad at night you know when they're awake he's a, he's got to work because they're awake abroad or whatever it is his business abroad I mean he's made he's only 26 he's bloody he's really successful it just works for him you know so fair play but don't ask questions and don't get on with it it's all computerised stuff isn't it not tapping he's going tapping all night oh oh give me an engine any day give me an engine not a topic computers oh struggle with this vlogging block, you know. I do manage. Sort of. So I'm just moving up and then going shopping at somewhere, Aldi. I think it's an Aldi nearby, so uh, Sunday. It's my, 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 um, it is my grandson's birthday. He's nine years old. Nine. Happy birthday, Lucas. He's off on his little travels, going around his mates, getting all the gifts. His mates, what you bought me then? And, yeah, I didn't want that, but I'll oh, thanks anyway. <laughs> what I mean, um, yeah, hands frozen already. You are the weakest link. Goodbye. I can't see it when I'm looking at the air. Look, that sign says the plough Huddlesford, so this must be Huddl Huddlesford around here. So I'm mooring at Huddlesford, Bridge 83. Beautiful. Pretty boat that, isn't it? So look at the paintwork, it's beautiful, isn't it? Looks like brand new. Oh. It's a pretty little house, isn't it? Those beautiful old windows, wow. I've been trying to clean them. Oof. Down here, you've got this little arm, it's called the Ugly, ugly junction or ugly junction, and there's no access. Mind your head, well, put your hell on your head then. So, down there's like the cruising club and the Litchfield Cruising Club, like a little arm, it's like a little safe little haven, like a little gate across it. Oh, it's beautiful. You've got the train lines here, look, thundering past all hours. God, they're so noisy. See, down there, look. Oh, lovely, lovely cruising club, you know, lovely. You can actually moor under this bridge um, for the plough, for the plough pub. I don't want to moor under there. Oh, under a train bridge. What's the noise? I love these bridges how they're on st st like feet, like vibrational feet, aren't they? All that weight is sat on those feet, look, you know? Amazing, isn't it? Like concrete, and there's trains, look, trains are off, like tons, aren't they, going over? This is the plough, look. And there's overspill parking all around here, so it's great for parking. You can hear a train coming. Bridge number 83. Oh, I smell a bacon then. Blimey! Must be the plough doing lunches or something. Cool, what a lovely smell. Mmm, me hungry. Mr. Van just there, look. See what I mean about parking next to your boat? I want to go a little bit further down, in front of that black and grey boat there. Get out 
of bed till about 11 o'clock. I was just busy doing vlogging and getting a vlog ready. And uh, bored now. Went to the rubbish to Fradley Junction. And then um, take Mike's car ahead with him. One of those days, isn't it? It's just rubbish, mate. Rubbish. Rain, rain, and more rain. It's still raining, it's going to rain all day. Look at this. This is it now until next year, isn't it? Soggy, muddy, sloppy. Mm, you chose that life, I know. Love it. Love the sloppiness. Great getting all of your carpets. I love it. Why have to laminate the floor then? No, I don't like it. It's too cold. Bradley Junction Lot is lovely. Just pinked some rubbish. Just brought Uncle Mike ahead with his car. Am I going to go back in my van? Looks like a lovely little place, doesn't it? You have to go through the pub to get to the bins. All right. Oh, it's lovely. Look at that. Friendly Junction. I'm impressed. Are these services here, are they? Uh, you've got water point. Oh yeah. Yeah, we walked past it. I can't this. It's the glare, isn't it? Just so. To your left. Ah, fantastic. Here we go. Bring in my. In the pub. And then back again. Yeah. Oh, secret little park in there, not Dirty little parker. Hey, it's a lovely little junction, isn't it? Oh, it rings a bell, this. Oh, it rings a bell because I came here with my little... When I bought my little plastic boat, 25 foot, remember turning down here. I bought it from Stoke-on-Trent and bought it all the way down to Kennet and Avon. Wow. Oh, you would have come that way, then. Yeah, I come that way, 25 foot plastic. Same as that little blue, that one up there. Yeah. Oh, all those years ago. Wow. but it's still cold inside, can you believe that? Look at this gorgeous so long. This gorgeous. Mate! <laughs> Why do you think it's this cold weather? Oh no, I've got you inside. It should be warm by now. But your feet are warm in that robe, oh dear. Oh no. It's gorgeous, look at that look. Isn't that beautiful to look at? Behold to the eyes. All the paths are frozen. Mr. Van's frozen. And all that gorgeous sort of a forest of misty plants frozen in time. I'm not getting, I'm not getting poetic, I'm just making it up. Right, I'm going to, heading to Fradley Junction today, about five miles away. Let's go with this. Firstly, I must remove the, the robes. You didn't say it. <laughs>
cold it is, even the condensation that's coming out the windows, condensation falls out these holes there a lot, and that's frozen. There a lot! Bloody that's how cold it is, Ripeth! That's how cold it is. Wow! It's been minus three or four last night. It still is, looks a bit. Apparently, the chap that owns this boat here has passed away, bless him. This has been left. So this, that's the story of that one. Oh, it's sad, isn't it? It is really sad. Perhaps that's perhaps sunken boats, not people that have passed away, the boat just sits there. All those happy times you had on that boat. Bless his heart. The engine thing is open, Lord. The engine bay is open. Oh no, hey! Okay. End of an era for that for that boat. Chimney's gone, look. Someone's taken the fire out of there. Stripped it probably. Oh, the windows and portholes are gone. Oh, shame. That doesn't happen to my boat. I my kids to take on my boat and do a good job. You know what I mean? Can you see that? Can you see the, the um, how its ice has formed on that solar panel? It's like a plant. It's like a plant that's grown all across it, sort of mimicking mimicking the natural kingdom, isn't it? Nature kingdom. A plant has come. Like a plant has grown all over it. Wow. It's stunning. Nature's stunning without even trying, isn't it? it? Must have been the cold air that's coming from that way. It's slowly formed over the. But it's come like it's, it's turned into like a plant um, image. Wow! See that? I can't see it because the sun's in my phone. That's just remarkable. And absolutely lovely to witness. Of course, it's gorgeous in the sun, but deadly. And I, I always feel for the um, the wildlife, you know, because there's nothing for them to eat now. It's nothing. Everything's frozen. They must starve for a bit, or dig down, or you know what I mean. I don't know how these little things survive. These humans need all this stuff to stay alive. All this warmth, food, water. Of course, they need food and water, but. They survive outside in their little feathers, tiny little legs. And they survive in the wild, it's incredible. As humans, we need so much gear, don't we, just to manage. Oh dear, look at all the traffic on the... Is it, might be the M42 there. Oh, all lined up, look. Oh, an awful place to be in here. I'm stuck in the traffic on the motorway. Sometimes you get busy on the old canals, you know, you get two or three boats lined up. It is chaos. So with the blue tit in the thing in there, little blue tits in the bushes there, look. Oh, beautiful to look at. If you want to look at wildlife, you can watch Mrs. Mindful, Mindful Narrowboat. She's amazing with the wildlife, she is. She gets proper images of birds, I'll just get glimpses. Bridge 84, someone's knocking at the door, Southern Bell, someone's knocking at the door, do me a favour, open the door, time to bloody F off, I'm sick of him! This is all the HS, this is all the HS2 works going on behind here, it's costing trillions, trillions, and I think it's only adding half an hour off your journey, what's that all about? I was talking to a guy yesterday, he said, they said they paid for his golf club to have their clubhouse moved at millions, it cost them. They moved it so they can put the HS2 through there, through their clubhouse. What's it costing taxpayers this lot? Oh my God, how on earth do they find the money for this stuff and we're, we're scrimping and bloody scraping? I think he's paying for this, we are. For increased taxes on your food and everything else. That's what else who's paying for it? Us lot. The stupid, <laughs> stupid ideas. And I think they're going to cut off the HS2 wax, it's costing too much. I'm not surprised! Oh, 
Anyway, look at my, my oh, two hats, look, rippers. When you're on YouTube and you become famous, you can wear two hats as well. And if you get more famous, you can wear three hats. And if you get really famous, you get one of those tall top hats, like the rich wear. What are those top hats? All the, they're the worst design hats I've ever seen in my life. Ooh, King's Ultramarine, look at this, look, rippers. What was I talking about? I've got no idea, but it's King's Orchard Marina here, lot, and it's well, I can't hold this camera very long. My hands are absolutely frozen. Ah! Oh. You can't wear gloves because you can't press the button on your touch screen. Well, here we are. Here's the marina. Oh, it is. Yeah, it is. You've got all your marina services here. Look, you're new and used boats, boat hire. Shopping channel, all thinking of selling. Ask us for a free value. Oh, so take Will's way in. Where's that shopping trolley come from? Must be a shop round here. Shopping trolley's there, look. How do people take those home? They're so bulky, they're heavy, they're hard to push. Why did you even think of taking one? There's another, another wharf here, look. Groceries, laundry here. Pump out. Wow, we've got it all down here, ain't you, Rippers? Oh, it's all going off here, isn't it? I wonder if there's like a bit of rivalry between between these companies. Don't get them down there, they charge a penny extra. Oh, their coal's not as good as our coal. Their diesel's watered down. <laughs> oh, look at that, look, boat's being blacked. Oh, I love to see that. Polished this prop as well, look. Oh, I love it. Look at that little thing. Yay! That, my furry little friends, is the A38. A38 there, not the M42. Oh, God, look at it, look. Oh, left Whittington. We've left Whittington, now we're heading to Fradley. Just reminding myself on camera. Whittington to Fradley. That'd be a nice little vlog, wouldn't it? Hey, Rippers. Amazing, isn't it? I'm going this way at three mile an hour, and they're going that way at three mile an hour. <laughs> oh no! Oh, hey! Because we passed the wonderful and mysterious Bridge 86, now we're going under the elusive, the exciting, the dark 87. Oh, wonderful! It's Bridgy, it's Archie, and it's Bricky. What more could you ask for from a bridge? Bridge, you've given us everything. You've given us your all, Bridgy. And he's also included some bridge nipples. Woohoo! What a bridge you are, mate! Two fat ladies side by side, 88. I don't like more near these bridges because people go bap, bap. Bap when they go over it, their cars. Bap, bap, bap. Oh god, I've got something. Oh no! Look at that crap in the water. Jeez. Just past that boat there, and I had to, I had to pull over to one side and pull it to one side, and this was shallow. It's a big rock down there. My boat went right over, stuck on the rock. Just got off it, just slid off it nicely. Bridge number 689, nearly. 89 of the pairs. A38, we're going under it now, and it's very, very low. We will. Mm, get the chimney under there. Yeah, yeah should be alright. Just. Oh, I can't even hold this camera, it's so cold. Ah, my hand's hurting already. Bloody wimp, you are now. I'm a cold wimp. Take my face is frozen. Oh, I've got to change my hands, my hands in my pocket a minute. Wow. This is a low one, isn't it, Ripith? A38. Look at that for an image, that's great, isn't it? Find your head. Just a bit lower. I'm trying to moor up, there's nobody 
to moor up. I want to moor up so I can please do some washing. Well, a couple of hours later, we're here at Friendly Junction in all its glory. I'm passing down here. I'm passing down here on my first plastic boat coming down that junction there. And I marvelled at its wondrousness. And the chap just coming down, he's turning round. And we're getting water repairs. Cheers, mate. And look at this lot. Oh, you beauty. That's what we need. You got your golf jacket on, ready for golf, have you? <laughs> yeah, ready for Sunday. <laughs> it's only what? Was it Wednesday? Yeah, I'm more ready for your birthday than you. Birthday. The birthday Saturday. Ooh, 2nd of December, Rippers.